We've been talking a lot of SU basketball tonight for obvious reasons, but the football team, they're back in the weight room getting in shape for spring practice with new head coach Fran Brown and his staff. And part of the training includes yoga, where the players are working on their balance, flexibility, and focus. They're also getting massages. In tonight's conversation, Carrie Lazarus sits down with a massage therapist who's on the team for football and other SU sports. Christopher Hess from Integrative Massage Associates. Thanks for having us. Well, thank you for coming. You've been working with SU Athletics for several years, women's field hockey and lacrosse. I know you've done women's basketball um, and now football. Uh, I've been working with the team for a couple years now, and in this part of the season, uh, when they're when they're off, they're the strength and recovery, uh, having massage as a part of that uh, to keep them in their best possible health and to avoid injury. Uh, that's really the name of the game. Can you talk about um, the importance of integrating massage into the training for these athletes? Oh, absolutely. They're, it's it's really invaluable. They already have a training staff that helps with the everyday aches and pains, keeping the muscles loose. But when you can incorporate a hands-on modality like massage therapy, where I can really, with my ability to feel where tension exists, where there's uh, a need for, for more attention, uh, it really can help avoid injury down the road, especially this time of year where they're really ramping up the amount of weight that they're lifting to prepare uh, for the next season. So what can massage do for these elite athletes? Uh, having a hands-on modality like massage can really help to loosen the connective tissue, uh, loosen the muscles themselves, help improve range of motion, uh, help body awareness as well, because sometimes people aren't even aware when they have tension or when they have stress, whether they're an athlete or not. I understand uh, that you've gotten pretty popular with the players, which is a good endorsement and they call you the barefoot guy <laughs> yeah. uh, as I walk around campus yeah I'm often I'm often barefoot uh, almost exclusively yeah and you then do massage without your shoes on I do it. yeah I do even in my office in, yeah. in my office environment or if I'm working up at SU um, I'm always barefoot it allows me to feel more grounded uh, and it allows me to control both my because I use a lot of body weight uh, mm -hmm. as part of my approach to really get into the tissues but what about the rest of us I mean strength training has become very important in terms of maintaining health as people get older. What can the rest of us get out of massage therapy? Physical activity, strength training is a, is a core aspect of everybody's health, and it really should be. But even on top of that, the, the fact that so many people spend all day sitting in a chair, staring at a monitor, mm -hmm. uh, typing on a keyboard, uh, these actions that everybody does every single day have detrimental effects on the body. So massage can ex expand range of motion, loosen tight tissue, relieve headaches in some cases if people have neck aches from the way that they look mm -hmm. at their monitors. Um, so all of those kind of things are all different aspects of, of what I do on a daily basis. All right, Christopher Press, get up to uh, SU. I'm they do need it. you and the fans want to see a better <laughs> team this year. Thank you, Carrie, very much.